is, well, we want you to stay on. See, I don't know those lyrics. My father would be there. I've been told. For 50 years or so, I've been more and more worried about Christmas. Christmas is not just a day. It's a frame of mind, and that's what they've been changing. Well, I'm glad you're taking me back. Maybe I can do something about it. I think so. I met you and your daughter. Yeah, I like just take out the bad ones. Yes, in a way, you're the whole thing in miniature. And if I win you over, well, there's still hope. If not, I guess I'm too. But I'll try. And I'm warning you, I don't give up easily. But Mr. Kringle, first thing in the morning, I think they're still there. The Sawyer's office for a little examination. Mental examination? Partly, yes. Oh, I don't mind. I'm taking those. Christmas tree poisoning. How many days in the week? Seven. How many things do you see? Four. What are the words to that song, though? Perfect. Who was vice president under James Monroe? Daniel D. Tompkins. I'll bet you Mr. Sawyer doesn't know that one. How much is three times five? You asked me that before. I'm conducting this examination. How much is three times five? Same as it was before. Fifteen. You're rather nervous, aren't you, Mr. Sawyer? Do you get enough sleep? My personal habits are of no concern to you. Oh, I'm sorry. It's just that I hate to see anyone all tied up. How many fingers do you see? Three. You bite your nails, too. I touch the mold. I want you to stand up straight with your arms extended. <laughs> Muscular coordination test. Good you know, very often nervous habits like yours is caused by insecurity. Are you happy at home, Mr. Sawyer? Or in my cake? That would be all, Mr. Kringle. You've never made this before? Really? No, it's easy. You just need to take strawberries. I've been a happily married man for 26 years. I'm delighted to hear it. Bye. Your wife, Mr. Sawyer. Oh, Agnes, how many times I told I'm you? I'm so sad this happened. No, I give you a perfectly I liberal allowance. Good if that stupid this. brother of yours began a job, you wouldn't have to be pestering me all the time. Mm, Not a penny. These ones are a little suspicious. How long have you known him, Dr. Pierce? Well, he wandered this. into the home about eight months ago. Looked okay, cool. Well, uh, <laughs> it'll do. Just stayed on. Oh, my God. No, I got pardoned. Have he ever told you his real name? He said he was me. Chris Kringle. We never pressed him further. Okay. This is Walker. After giving that man a comprehensive examination, it's my considered opinion that you should be dismissed immediately. Uh, Dr. Pierce, Mr. Sawyer. Uh, didn't Chris answer the questions correctly? Well, yes, he did, but there was a complete lack of concentration. There's no doubt about it. It's in a mental institution. Oh, wait a minute. People are institutionalized to prevent them from hurting themselves. Super or easy, people. super simple. This is a delusion. I really like it. He only wants you to put your strawberries out. in. Just a bowl. This is Walker. And you mush them. Oh, this is kind of. Man. So when he begins to exhibit his latent maniacal tendencies, which I assure you, you he will, the responsibility will be entirely yours. Oh. Less to clean up so we can get to dinner at your folks' house. What trouble could Chris possibly get into? No. Coming to work, for instance, a policeman might ask his name. These are going to be easier. You know that would get him into a fight. Well, that could be avoided easily enough. Find someone here in the store and find him a room. Then they could go to and from work together. Oh, yes, that would solve everything. That's a wonderful idea. Yes, isn't it? Uh, you're still away at school. What about his room? Well, I'll talk to Mrs. Shell Hammer as soon as I get back. In the meantime, you take Chris home to dinner. Oh, no, I couldn't. Oh, really, Mrs. Walker? If I can supply the room, the least you can do is furnish a free meal. See, I just don't know the words. I really can't say What sort of game does he play, Susan? I don't play much with the children. They play silly games. They do? Like today. They were playing zoo. And all of the children were animals. Oh, just like Homer ice. was supposed to be the zookeeper. Song he said, what kind of an animal are you? I said, I'm not an animal. I'm a girl. Okay. He said, only animals go out here. Let's try this Bye. Oh, that's too bad. Sounds like a wonderful game to me. Of course, a little better. Play, you've got to have Still need a bit. Do you know what imagination is? That's when you see something and it's really not there. Well, yes. What are you wearing tonight? Imagination is a place by itself. Yeah, you know, like, well, you know, the British nation and the French nation. Well, this is imagination. Mm. Say, how 
How would you like to make snowballs in the summertime? Well, usually I people use, South like, Avenue. well, okay, I say usually. Usually I, I use of Liberty in the morning. a potato and masher. The afternoon, a flock of I don't geese think I have flying any. south. Well, the first place. I'm using my hands. <laughs> They're clean, I promise. You hey, you sleep Homer in the same bed as me and you kiss his mouth. I don't know so. how to be a monkey. I'll show you. Mm -hmm. Stand up. First, you bend way over. Can you smell the cakes? That's it. Keep your arms loose. God, it smells so good. Is Angel food cake? I think it's different than shortbread, right? Yeah, this one's shortbread. Sherman and Hazlip has been very good to me. In the summer, I like to do just strawberries on top of the cake, but do people eat shortbread at Christmas? Is that just me? Is that weird? We can add so many things to it to make it like so festive. Like put anything chocolate on there, right? Pour this over it. Put some strawberries on top for decoration. And then put anything, chocolate on top, pieces of chocolate, chocolate chips, a drizzle, a sauce. You could even put chocolate covered strawberries on top. That would be way cute. Whipped cream. And then you can get those little tiny leaves. Yeah, you can decorate with like little holly leaves, I think, right? I've seen cakes. <laughs> yeah, and then you decorate it. No, and it looks like Christmas. Gave it to me. Cut venison or yeah. Yeah, deer meat. If you don't like it, I have eggs for you. Does this sound gross? I'm sorry. I have eggs too. I think it's kind of cool. Venison, you know. I could. You could do something with this for Halloween too. Oh, I can get this. I forgot. Ew. That's, cool. <laughs> That's so gross. You want for Christmas? Oh my god. Are you sure you want to cook with me? Is this going to ruin the food for you? I <laughs> got You sure? Off. A doll's house like this? No, a real house. A real house. Really Alright, now if you want to be the one to pour the sugar, I'll just tell you when. We'll go by taste. Here. Well, just because More. every child doesn't get his wish. More. That mean uh, maybe that's good. Just mix it up. You want to be kind of like saucy still? But not too much, because if you make it too runny, it runs down the cake. This actually looks pretty decent. You go first here. Yeah, what do you think? Good night, Susan. Let me see. No, that's it. Mm -hmm. That's perfect. Do you like living in the city? So now we're gonna go. I kind of like get out in the country sometime, though. Not a big place. Just one of those junior partner deals in Manhattan. I know the kind of oh, they're so warm for me. One of those colonial houses. Yeah, and then you can just pour it on top. Um, in the past, I've just kind of like crumbled the cake over it, which was yeah, really nice. Um, but I think we're going to pour this one over the top. No one will ever again. Yeah, no more that's why we baked it with that little like indent she there. Made to crawl out of a shell. So that it doesn't hopefully run that much. No. But it's still, well, it's so good when it like soaks so into the cake and the bread. You want to try a little bite? And then we have to get ready to go. See, it's nice that once you've got the cakes on, this one goes so quick. Here. Try it. Is it good? Let me see. Oh my god, it is good. They're going to love this. Does Santa Claus sleep in the Twisted inside?